Top 10 Insane Robot Predictions for 2022 By 2022, robotics trends and forecasts will improve the global technology industry. The pandemic presented both challenges and opportunities for robotics companies. Unexpected supply chain pressures and product shortages have highlighted the need to improve supply chain efficiency. Various industries have also suffered from labor shortages caused by health and safety regulations. The lessons learned in 2021 can be applied to the goals and trends of the robotics industry in 2022. Here, you can find some trends and predictions in the robotic industry for 2022. 1. Teslabot Elon Musk has confirmed that Tesla will launch a prototype for a humanoid robot this year that has been created to carry out, quote, boring, repetitive, and dangerous work. Making the shock announcement at the Tesla AI Day event, the U.S. carmaker's billionaire CEO said the robot would measure in at 5 feet 8 inches, weigh 65 kilograms, and be capable of attaching bolts to cars with a spanner or more complex tasks like picking up groceries at your local shop. Describing Tesla's latest creation as having, quote, profound implications for the economy, Musk suggested that the new droid will plug gaps created by labor shortages. 2. Smart Factories Smart factories are production companies and factories with a level of automation and digitalization that allows them to take advantage of the potential of the latest technologies to improve their productivity and create more flexible and streamlined processes. These types of factories operate within the realms of Industry 4.0, also known as the Connected Industry. In this industry, what stands out most is how data and information flows are created, as well as the involvement of robots and humans in those processes. 3. The Rise of AI Robots Robots and Artificial Intelligence AI, are expected to permeate our daily lives by 2025. This could have huge implications on several business sectors, most notably healthcare, customer service, and logistics. Already, AI is responsible for medical research breakthroughs and climate research, not to mention self-driving cars. Will robots replace human workers? The answer to that seems to be divided. According to Pew Research, about half, 48% of experts surveyed felt that robots and digital agents will displace a significant number of blue and white collar jobs. Their concern is that this will increase income inequality and create a mass of virtually unemployable people. The other half, 52%, expect robotics and AI to create more jobs than they take. This latter half believes that while AI will replace humans, these experts have faith in human ingenuity to create new jobs, industries, and new ways of making a living, much like at the dawn of the Industrial Revolution. 4. Neuralink Elon Musk has said that Neuralink, his brain interface technology company, hopes to start implanting its microchips in humans this year. Neuralink, co-founded by Musk in 2016, is developing a chip that would be implanted in people's brains to simultaneously record and stimulate the brain activity. It's intended to have medical applications, such as treating serious spinal cord injuries and neurological disorders. During a live-streamed interview at the Wall Street Journal's CEO Council Summit, Musk was asked what Neuralink planned to do in 2022. Musk said, Neuralink's working well in monkeys and we're actually doing just a lot of testing and just confirming that it's very safe and reliable and the Neuralink device can be removed safely. Progress will accelerate when we have devices in humans. Hard to have nuanced conversations with monkeys next year, he said. 5. Collaborative Robots Known as Cobots, Collaborative robots are automated solutions designed to work with and alongside the human workforce, making their jobs easier by completing monotonous or physically demanding tasks. The objective of cobots is to enhance human-robot collaboration. Instead of replacing a person, a cobot can work together with humans, resulting in increased output and improved efficiency across the board. Typically, cobots are defined as fixed robotic arms that are designed to operate intuitively and safely around people. 
but today the definition and use cases of collaborative robots are expanding. The term cobot not only refers to arms, but also mobile robots that work alongside humans. Combine these by adding a cobot arm to an autonomous mobile robot, AMR, and you get a powerful mobile manipulator that offers the ultimate in flexibility and utility. Furthermore, the merger of these two technologies in an easy-to-use format will allow more widespread use of cobots by more workers in a wider variety of applications. 6. Not robo-tanks, but microservices. Robot tanks and drones swarming the battlefield represent only a small fraction of the ways the military might put autonomy to use in the years ahead. Most troops will likely experience autonomy first as a helping hand in various tasks, from making it easier to drive, to collecting intelligence, to managing base logistics, autonomy experts from industry and the Pentagon said Thursday. And as troops get comfortable with software tools that lighten their loads, they will build trust and familiarity with the fully autonomous hardware that will eventually arrive. But even the private sector doesn't have fully autonomous fleets of self-driving vehicles yet, despite the availability of machine vision and sensing tools that are impractical for combat settings. 7. Robot Delivery Service Hundreds of little robots are rolling around colleges and cities in the United States, Britain, and elsewhere. The robots, about 50 centimeters tall, are bringing food like pizza to hungry students. The robots were being tested in limited numbers before the pandemic started. But pandemic-related worker shortages and a desire for contactless delivery have expanded their use. Quote, We saw demand for robot usage just go through the ceiling, said Alistair Westgarth. He is the head of Starship Technologies, whose robots recently made their 12 millionth delivery. Quote, I think demand has always been there, but it was brought forward by the pandemic effect. Starship has deployed more than 1,000 robots, up from just 250 in 2019. Hundreds more will be sent out soon. They are delivering food at 20 U.S. colleges and 25 more will be added soon. They are also operating in Milton Keynes, England, Modesto, California, and the company's hometown of Tallinn, Estonia. When a robot arrives, people enter a code from their phones to open the robot and get their food. There are some limitations for now. The robots have to be recharged regularly. They are slow and cannot travel far. They will not leave food at the door, and big cities like New York and Beijing are not welcoming them. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications to see more of our future videos. With that said, keep enjoying our videos, and I'll see you in the next video.